to Coding with Kids. My name is Kalia. And my name is Andrew. Today we're on Minecraft Education. So we're on Python 101 and Lesson 5. So we're going to talk to the CEO. So the CEO says, Hi again. Since you have been of such help for this company, I want to show you our newest creation, a robot companion called the Agent. The Agent can be controlled with code and can help people in every part of day-to-day -day life. It can help you around the house and at work. Down here, we are testing the agent to help at home. So let's see what this lever does. Switch. Ooh, there are lots of agents. But this one is an agent or a bunch of peeps. Yeah, this Hi, agent. The agent says, Hi, I'm the agent and I'll be your helper and companion throughout this journey. Can you help code me to become smarter? So we're going to help the agent to become smarter. Okay. Good. Now we're going to talk to the developer. So the developer says, Hi, would it be possible to get your help? I need to write some code that will move the bars from one side to the other. This will greatly help people who can't move heavy objects that easily. But I cannot seem to make the agent move correctly. Could you write some code some code to help me with this? So we're gonna help the help her get the agent to get barrels and put the barrel on the piston. Okay. So part one. Write some code so that the agent will pick up the box and move six box forward and place it forward. So first we're gonna do agent dot collect all. So it will collect everything. Everything around it. Okay. Next we're gonna do agent dot move forward six times. Okay. So they will go to the piston uh, the block before the piston. Then agent place forward. Okay, place forward. So place the bar I picked up on the piston. So now let's run. Okay, okay picks up the bar and puts it on the piston. Now I'm gonna go to part two. Okay, so now it's a little different. Okay. So part two. I did the same code so that the agent goes back to the starting point. It needs to do the same thing but four times. Use a for loop at the beginning. The boxes will autom be automatically stacked. Okay, so we're gonna all do all this. Tab, tab it. These are gonna put it all inside the loop. So we're gonna do for i in oops for a i in, in range. range. Repeat four times because there will be four. Four times. times. We're gonna do after the agent dot place forward. We're gonna do agent dot move. We'll do back. How many times? Six. Six. So we'll go back to the beginning because the agent dot collect all will only collect one bar at a time. Okay. Okay. So the piston lift it out, lift the bars out, so the agent will have enough space to put the bar. Out. Okay. Now we're gonna go to activity two. So now we're gonna talk to the tester. tester. Hello, so the tester. tester says, "Could I ask for your help? I've been testing the agent, and I found that if it spins left twenty times, that's when the clothes get clean. However, I can't get the program to work. Could you write some code so that?" will some code that will make the agent go into the machine spin around left 20 times then go out okay so first we're gonna go here so this is the pretend wash machine and the agent needs to get the lever change plate which is basically the clothes they need to clean spin around here to clean the clothes and then go back okay so part one Write some code so that the agent will pick up the dirty laundry, move forward into the machine, spin left 20 times, and then get out of the machine to place the clean laundry on the other side of where the dirty laundry was. So we have a code, agent.collect doll, agent.move forward 7 times, and agent.drop all forward. So first we're going to do for i1 in range, um, how many times? 20. 20 times. Because then you need to spin 20 times. Then we're going to do agent dot turn left. Left. Okay. Then we're going to do agent dot collect agent dot collect all. Collect 
for the and digital press, collector. The, and the agent turn left, you uh, need to tab it, two. and then left, then underscore, then turn. So the agent will turn left, not just left. Left, left. Left, left turn, okay. How about this? Is this in the loop? No. Let's see. No, okay. Then we're going to do agent dot move. Back seven times. Oops. Back seven times. So we'll go back to the beginning. And then agent dot drop left. Left. Now we're on the right. Agent drop all. Drop underscore all. So drop all. The clean clothes left. Okay, so now let's run. Oh, yeah. Now it's spinning. Okay, Ooh. now there's, it's enchanted. So it's so clean. basically clean. Now we're going to go here. Okay. Part two. Part two. Edit the same code so that the agent does the same thing but for free loads of laundry. Do this by using for loop before all of the other code. So we are going to do all this. Do a tab. Because we're going to do it in a loop. Alright, you enter. So for... Hmm. Loop. Let's do this. Tab. Okay. And... You're gonna do for I do I two in range. Repeat three times. So we'll do three loads of laundry. Is that correct? Okay, now that's right. Let's go. Let's go clean Hi. agent. Okay, so now the clean chest plate now needs to clean the boots. Okay, the boots, boots is clean. Right? Yeah, I think so. Now I think it's pants. Yes, pants. Yay! So now there's armor. Okay, this is complete. Let's go to activity three. The carpets. So we're going to talk to the programmer. So the programmer says, Sorry to bother you. Could I get your help? I'm trying to make the agent vacuum dirt off some carpets. But I can't seem to get the agent to vacuum the whole carpet. It just goes over a small part. Could you write some code that will make the agent vacuum the whole carpet? Okay. So, okay. So I think the seeds are the dirt. Because they look pretty much like dirt. Okay. So the agent needs to clean the carpet. So part one. Write some code so that the agent will go over every block, small carpet, and pick up the dirt. So first there is agent dot collect all. Agent dot move forward one and agent move right one. Okay. So first over here we are gonna do four. I1 and range. Okay, we're gonna do it seven times. So we're gonna put these two lines inside agent the loop. All and agent dot move. Yeah, okay. And then for I2 and range. We are gonna do it also seven times. Okay, then we're going to do tab agent dot collect all. So collect all the seeds around it. Then we're going to do agent dot move back. <sighs> yeah, that's it. So go back one time. Then we're going to do agent dot. Okay. So now we are going to run it. Okay. Yay. So it goes through the whole carpet. So we clean up all the seeds or so called dirt. Okay, now we are going to help clean a bigger carpet. So part two. Edit the same code that the agent does the same thing before the larger carpet. You do this by repeating the code three times using a for loop. At the end, try to make the agent drop all the dirt in the trash to its right. So first, we are going to do 
here before I say in range. Okay, how many, how many times? Three times. Time? Three times. Okay. Then you're gonna move all this tab. Okay. So now we are gonna move part two. Make the agent move right. So we're gonna do agent dot move right. One. One. Okay. That's the end of the third loop. Then we're gonna do agent dot drop all right. So drop all to the trash can and but it's over right. there in the agent that move right it is already end of loop two so we don't need the first the a tab because it's not end of for i2 in range okay so now we're right. Yay. go 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 the agent is so fast and it's like you yeah. swing its arms two so more silly. seats one more seat Yay, clean it, but it's still need to go over the whole carpet. Okay, oh. so we'll throw all the seeds in the track. Ooh, rockets. Hi. So throw all of the seeds here, right, and okay. then the trash can. So called trash can. Okay, now. Okay, so now you're gonna go in the elevator. Yeah. Okay, so now we're back at the start. Well, that was fun, and, and that's it for today. today. Thank you for watching. Remember to smash the like button and subscribe. Bye bye.